Hey folks, Rob here. And uh, had a pretty good ammo, ammo score this week. Uh, Walmart actually paid off. Uh, this is over a, a three day period here. So this is three days. Our Walmart has a uh, three box limit. So, you know, you can get three boxes. Although I could have, I could have got more of this today if I had been a greedy person, but I'm not. And uh, so uh, I feel like, uh, you know, we ought to leave some for the next guy. But uh, let's go, uh, let's start here first. And this is, this is two days worth. So I got uh, three boxes. Uh, I think it was yesterday I got these. The Winchester AA uh, 28 gauge. Uh, these are the two and three quarter inch, 1300 feet per second um ammunition and i bought these on let's see what the date is on the receipt five nine so i got these on the ninth which uh, i'm not even sure what day it is but that's when i got these uh and then and these were you can see there they were 987 a box for those and then the day before that, I actually picked up two boxes. Same thing. Uh, we shot one yesterday, if you watched the video. You actually seen me pull one of them out. So, this week I have scored five boxes of the Winchester uh, 28-gauge ammunition. And like I said, we shot one box of this yesterday in the Hatfield but today was the big big score day um, I talked to my wife this morning uh, I had to ask her to stop by Walmart she was running a little early I asked her to stop by Walmart I was really looking for some 410 shells and uh, she called me and she said they have 22 ammunition and she said they have a lot of it and I'm like, really, how much is a lot? She said, there's probably, there's two shells full. There's probably a hundred boxes of this. So I said, okay, well, get my three boxes. Of course, you know, I could have jumped in my truck and I could have went out there and got three more boxes because she picked up three. But, you know, that's, that's being greedy. So anyway, what we got today was Remington Thunderbolts. These are the 500 round box of Remington Thunderbolts. So the big green is back in business. They're making an ammo. And it is at Walmart. So they, she said they literally had 100 of these. So I called my brother and he went out there and got him three. Uh, or actually he just got two. And uh a buddy of mine who shoots I called him and he, he went and got him a couple but uh, I did get my three box limit and these were that's what I paid for these so there is 1500 rounds of 22 long rifle ammunition to go along with my five boxes of 28 gauge still looking for 410 uh, but I hadn't seen any uh, 22 at our Walmart in quite some time. And I was talking to my brother today. My wife got these before 8 a.m. this morning. And uh, his son, he actually told his son, and his son went out there and got uh, got himself three boxes of this at 2.30, and they still had ammunition. So hopefully they got enough in that, uh, you know, a lot of people can can get them some ammunition to do them for a while but uh so not a lot coming in yet they uh, she uh they were some 22 long rifle they had some 308 winchester they had uh 12 gauge slugs uh they had some 12 gauge ammunition uh which i'm pretty well stocked up on i don't really need to buy any more 12 gauge i would like to find some decent 20 gauge hunting ammunition uh and maybe some actually some 28 gauge and some 410 but 
the seven and a half shot. This is good for just going out and, and shooting, but I'd actually like to try to uh, take the uh, Hatfield uh, 28 gauge out and actually use it to maybe uh, squirrel hunt a little bit with. Uh, spring squirrels hunting season comes in here in Kentucky on uh, uh, May 15th, so I think it's Saturday. I don't know where I work nights anymore. I sleep of a day and I'm all messed up. I don't even know what day it is most of the time. So anyway, guys, this is just a look at uh, the ammo score that uh, I've had over the last few days. Not a lot, but, you know, this right here is the, the big score. Uh, and I'm sure the, uh, the price gougers and scalpers were tickled to death to see this on the shelf. And I'm actually surprised it lasted as long as it did. Uh, because, you know, I was looking, I just thought, okay, what, what are, what are these bringing? And I got online like ammo seek and, uh, you know, people are asking, you know, a hundred dollars for one of these, uh, would, would you pay a hundred dollars for this? That's, I, I'd like to know if, if it came down, I guess if you absolutely positively needed it you know, a hundred dollars, but you know, would you pay a hundred dollars for a box of Thunderbolts? I wouldn't. Before I would pay that, I just wouldn't shoot. Uh, keep what I got and just use it sparingly and when I needed it and, and uh, just cut back on the shooting, you know. Uh, like I said, during that, uh, after the Sandy Hook thing and you couldn't get, uh, you know, 22 ammunition the last time, I ended up selling every 22 I owned because I refused to uh, to pay that kind of money for something that, uh, you know, 22 is a great round. Don't get me wrong. It's got a lot of uses, but it's mostly just to go out and shoot, you know, poke holes in paper and shoot 10 cans. And that's what I use it for mostly. I know you can rabbit hunt with it and, you know, squirrel hunt and you can do that, but you know, uh, if you used it primarily just for hunting, uh, this box here would last you, you know, forever. Um, unless you were just a subsistence living and you had to go out and shoot something every day. I mean, you know, if I, if I bought this box here just to solely hunt with, for what I use a 22 for, which is almost never to hunt with, this would last me the rest of my life. So... Uh, that's just kind of my thoughts. I know a lot of people use a 22, but, you know, I always use the shotgun to hunt with. So. Uh, so anyway, guys, I'm rambling again, as I usually do. I wish somebody out there would just tell me to shut up and get the video over. <laughs> anyway, guys, I appreciate everybody watching. I hope you all out there is fight, being able to find some ammo. I don't put these videos out here to gloat and to... You know, say, oh, look what I got. This is to, I put them out here to give y'all a little bit of hope that, yeah, maybe, uh, maybe your Walmart will have some Remington hit the shelves before long. And if it's like my Walmart, maybe it'll be in the, uh, a substantial enough quantity that everybody can get a little bit. So, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate that. And, uh, I appreciate everybody that watches my videos. And, uh, takes time to leave comments and thumbs up and you know uh i appreciate it anyway guys till next video we'll see you later